Hello everyone, it's One Man One Camera. Today is March 28th, about 4 in the afternoon. Temperature feels like 80 degrees. My phone says it's 76. Here we are taking a look at Resorts World Las Vegas. Just a nice quick update to see what's going on. It is a lovely day out here in Vegas. It is Sunday afternoon, so a lot of folks probably are on the way back out of the city because it is not as crowded at Tacos El Gordo as it usually is when I come by here in the morning. So there you go. Now, Resorts World Las Vegas recently announced their 24,000 square foot food hall, which name I forget at the moment, so I'll put on the screen right there. Ah, good name. Now, it's going to have 16 different restaurants. It'll be some Asian, Asian flair, oh, sorry, some Asian dishes, hawker style food, and also some American food also. Um, it looks pretty exciting, actually. A lot of places do look tasty. A lot of them I've never even heard of, which is nice. And I'm not going to go over each individual one, but I'll maybe do a scroll up the screen or something like that so you can take a look see. And I will include the link to Resorts World Las Vegas' website. And you can go in there and, you know, check those things yourself. But also remember, once you go in there and check those names, you can also Google the names yourself to see what it's like, what their, what their menu is like. You even check some of the prices they have over there. So, now of course, this is Resorts World Las Vegas on the Strip, so I imagine the prices will be higher than the ones that you see uh, online for those companies websites okay all right anyway it's a lovely day come on let's walk straight down and see what's going on this corner of the complex will hold club zook z-o-u-k out of singapore i believe and the club zook does have a very strong name and so hopefully when things get when things get better here it'll be a lovely club a lot of fun bringing the people, bringing foot traffic up here. Let's hope for the best. Now, as far as opening date, it still says opening summer 2021, which means any not any time between now and September. So I have heard something, someone said like May 14th, I saw on a uh, on a tweet on Twitter one day, but you know, I haven't seen anything from Resorts World itself saying, hey, we're having a, you know, a grand opening, a soft opening, nothing like that. So, you know, uh, I think probably after July, maybe, because if you look at the exterior, there's still a lot of work to be done. And even as you can see somewhat inside in the interior of Club Zoo, you can see the framing isn't completely done on the inside, or the interior is not done yet. So there you go. Okay, now this 19,000 square foot sign on the East Tower is looking pretty good actually. It's doing their testing and it just says Resorts World Las Vegas with the logo spinning around. It looks pretty good. The colors are bright enough on this day to see them. It's a daytime and so uh, looks good you guys. Looks very good. Now the exterior hasn't changed very much since our last time we were here so not really much to say on that you guys. Just take a look see. A little bit of glare from the sunshine. There's our giant 100,000 square foot screen doing this thing as usual, and so on. And there's the big 10,000 square foot marquee, still saying opening summer 2021. I know a lot of times places seem like they want to keep it, you know, top secret as far as when they're going to open. And I do wish they would just say, look, our target date is here, so uh, be there or be square. Now my voice may sound a little funny, as I was, I've been under the weather this past week or so, so my voice doesn't have a usual, you know, sexy one-man, one-camera zing to it. Apologies, ladies. Okay, so the Drew is still standing there, owned by the Koch brothers. Uh, no announcement as far as any type of construction going on, blah, 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 blah. I got no comment. This guy walked by and said, hey man, you are not taking a picture of that piece of shit I saw, are you? <laughs> anyway. So, but anyway, in front of the uh, Las Vegas Convention Center, Check it out, this is all uh, open now. Like one big future parking lot. Looks pretty good actually. Nice and smooth. I presume they will uh, add some lines to it eventually. So hey, I think it's good. Okay, now let's turn back over this way. And there is Resorts World. In all of its glory. So, you know, it's looking good. Overall, I think Resorts World does look looking good. The names are up there. The fonts, I don't have any problem with. Some folks, some folks don't like the fonts. The fonts look fine to me. Um, I just hope the place can open 
And when it opens, I hope it's a hit. I hope there's no, uh, there's no glitches when they first open up because, as usual, well, typically whenever new shops open, you know, there was some teething problems for, for the first little bit of time. Let's hope it all goes smooth. And any teething problems, let's hope they're all dinky and small. So overall, you know, it's looking good down here. Looking good. Las Vegas Convention Center. West Hall North Lobby. All right, you guys, this will be a short video today. Um, like I said, the exterior hasn't changed too much. Recent announcements, just the food court, well, food court, sorry, food hall. Food court denotes something uh, like a mall. Food hall uh, is supposed to sound more upscale. I don't know, it's, a, it's an area where food, it's an area full of restaurants and where they're, uh, you know, you grab your plate and sit down yourself. How about you guys? Anyway, like I always say, if you see me outside, say hello and I'll say hello back. Take care, wherever you are, and have a great day.